don't know what is going on in this country. Everybody is suffering. Concerning the economy breakdown, and aside that, individual in each family, they are suffering from one issue or the other. They cannot be able to provide the daily need. And the government should be able to look inward and be able to provide the necessity to the citizens of this country. If they can be able to do that, I don't think there is any need for individuals to be talking about agitation. It's because the country is not well, it's suffering from a lot of a diseases and a lot of a pandemic. We are talking about the pandemic. It's not only when you contact diseases or those things. We are talking about a degradation of economy. That to the extent that individual and individual is very difficult for them to be able to avoid their daily bread. Going to the market, a banana you see is very high in the market. A banana of 200 for the past two years. They are selling it 1,000, 5,000. Imagine that even the agricultural concerning the, the, the S men over there as well, they did not give the farmer a chance to be able to farm, to be able to bring the food to the common table. You can see going from one place is order discover that the, the, the Nigeria itself has to do something, look inward. Even the presidency to be able to look inward and be able to solve the problem individual. So not only giving the money out, then the our government, also called the, the, the House of Representatives, the representative and uh, the out of Senate. They should be able to do the right thing, do the needs concerning the law they are talking about. Be implementing the law that will affect the life of the city is one of the most important things. They cannot just sit down and they ask to sit down in the House of Assembly there. They have been dictating and do some certain things for the individual. So you should be able to go down, go to the local government, ask people from various places, what is the problem of this country? What can we do to be able to provide food for the common table, for the common men in the country? So you can see, being around in the House of discover that the government, presidents should be able to look inward and be able to do the needful for the members of the citizens to be able to enjoy the value added. Uh, this is. You can imagine the uh, also called the light, the electricity is is not where to be found. Even to to that extent, there is no way the person that learn something has to do with electricity cannot be able to afford the bill of electricity in our community. Going to agricultural center is not where to be found. The economy is not viable. So be around the top, so be agitating for the separation of this country, at least it's because of this suffering has men here and there, one issue or the other, so the company is not at rest. So if we can be able to run it together, then look at what we discover that, in fact, the country is where to be separated because they are not meet the need of the citizen. And when they didn't meet the need of the citizen, at least people will be agitating. But if you provide the common food for individuals in the society, at least there's no point of going say, I want to separate, I want to separate because of the suffering is too much in this country. Government as well should be able to look at what and be able to solve this, the problem of the season. Thank you. The commissioning of one project or the other does not signify that there is going to be peace in the land because whatever everybody is passing through is in his mind. So commission this, commission that is more, is, is very good for you to be commission project. That will also put table food on the individual table to be able to provide employment in the country. But still, they still have to look another way, diversify, diversification of uh, uh, what's it called? Uh, economy in different ways. Going to the east to commission is part of the idea to be able to, to bring the agitation down. Being shown himself over there as well is good. But people are know that uh, we still value uh, the still value the evil people in our community. So being doing that is doing a well done job. But see, you see how to work, do the needful for the member of the Niger Delta and the member of the, the East Ego people to be able to provide the needful so, so that you can be able to, the word of emulation, you can be able to praise him well, that he's doing well. So, as it, at this point, to so let the government go work, go in well and do the right thing for the benefit of the Igbo people in, the, in this Nigeria. Uh, being detained Igbo and as well detained uh, Namlikano over there, at least they have to look inward and make sure they sort this out. You cannot be detained in Goho and detained in Namdikano and want peace to reign. First of all, release them. Once you release the Goho and you release the Namdikano, at least try to, to do the kind of uh, uh, visit the header, try to bring them together, then hear their opinion. They should talk to each other. If they really want the peace to reign in this country, I'm not sure they, they, there is any need for you to detain Igoho and uh, also go and the Namdikano for now. They should be able to release them. Call upon the header of the Yoruba as well, they are agitating for. Call the header of the other side of the ego. Then let them come together. Once they come together, at least they will seek another opinion to move forward. So when they can be able to lay hand on what they need, at least the peace will be established in this country and everybody will be seen to enjoy himself.
But if they continue to detain Igbo, they continue to detain the in Americano as well. I'm not sure. Even if we say there is a peace, there is a peace, we are deceiving ourselves. Because people, people of Niger Delta and the people of Igbo at large, they, they will not happy. Because why why other things are going on in the in the northeast and the northwest, they are killing themselves. And you cannot be able to lay hands on those people and you are detained go over there, detained Amdikano. So I think they have to do something concerning their release immediately. Because the election is oncoming now. As the election is coming, if they cannot be able to do some this thing out before the election comes, I'm not sure the grievance you see is going to be showcased during the election. So they should be able to do something before the arrival of the election, before they can be able to, to solve this thing. By so doing, we discover that the peace will be established in this region. So what they need before they call for the agitation is because the uh, leaders they are not be doing the right thing. They only met for their own alone. They, whatever they get from there, they pocket it. They did not go down. Immediately we vote for them. They go to Abuja. They have their arrest over there. Majority will build that over there. They will not come to their local government. They will not come to their state. And they be, they be say, ah, we are, we, we are at peace. We are not at peace. Let the people we vote for come down. Let them come down to the local government, state level, local government level, and the, let them go and build out there and feel the path and feel the way we are feeling here. Let them do, go there and feel the path so they can be able to do something. They cannot be doing all this thing and think their peace will be reigned. No, it's not possible. Let them do the right thing. Their leader, our politicians, they have to involve, bring them together. It's not until we vote for them that they will, they will let the community and be, and be going to Abuja to go and do what, to go and rest over there and be eating the money. Let the money go down. I let the economy be viable. Being voted there, he does not mean we vote there to go and sit down in Abuja or also rock. We vote for them to be able to, to impact, to impact into the into less privilege, provide necessary job opportunity, employment opportunity, and not only for the less privileged, so we can be able to have it at, 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 at our own disposal. We are not being followed the rule of law. Once we are being say release, the government have given judgment that you should release those that have been detained by DSS. There is no point, there is no argue on it. They should be able to release those people to go to their way because the government have already given judgment. So if they are really doing the right thing, they are only following the rule of law in this country, they should be able to release all those people. There is no point of holding them there, detain them for what? They should be able to release them to go back to their various places, to go and meet their family. There is no point, they have to release them based on the government and based on the order from the court. They have to release them. Thank you.